We continue our coverage from the town square here in Portales, New Mexico, the winner of our This Week in Your Town contest. This year's winning entry was submitted by Matt Rush, an eighth generation rancher here in Portales. Matt is president of the Roosevelt County Farm Bureau, but his political aspirations extend beyond Portales. For this young cattle producer, telling the story of agriculture has never been more important than it is right now. For the last 13 months, he's not only been running his cattle, he's been running for statewide office. It's just a mixed breed, mostly Hereford Angus Cross is predominantly what we run. Matt Rush hasn't been home much over the last 13 months, but when he is home, he likes to spend his time here on his 800-acre ranch just north of Portales. With 150 head of Hereford Angus Cross cattle, the serenity is only broken by the lowing of mama cows. It's a sound Rush hasn't heard much these days. Since the end of last year, he's been on the campaign trail, running for New Mexico State Land Commissioner. It's an office that not only impacts farmers and ranchers here, but the entire educational future of New Mexico. You know, the state of New Mexico owns 9 million acres of land, 13 million acres of mineral rights. The land commissioner out here is in charge of working with the farmers and ranchers that lease the surface rights of our state trust lands, the oil and gas industry that lease the mineral rights, and then all the funds generated from these lands is then deposited into a permanent fund, which then in turn predominantly funds the education system of our state. At 36, Matt Rush is an old hand at ranching, but new to politics. This is his first shot at a statewide elected office. It's something he says is important to him right now. He says having a farmer and rancher in office will hopefully make New Mexicans have a greater appreciation for the industry that not only drives the state economy, but the nation's economy as well. Ooh, we're going to have a great sunset later. 